up, brother? Hey, man. Uh, just want to let you know I fly in late Thursday night. I think it's around 9, 30 or 10. I'll call you a little later. If I don't hear from you tonight, I'll call you tomorrow. And if not, I'll see you soon. This country is just crazy. Unforgiving. Just the rocks and just all the different kinds of cactuses and the things that can poke you and hurt you. And the desert's crazy. My name is Josh De La Garza. I've been native here in New Mexico all my life, pretty much. Been hunting this unit 12, 13 years. I'm just checking out the maps I downloaded offline. Uh, Did the deer ever get in there? Oh, yeah. Uh, pretty successful bow hunter so he invited me down here to kind of hunt with him and just kind of been staying in touch finally drew the tag right yes sir and uh here we are in new mexico dude it's awesome you gonna get it done let's get it done let's do it i think that i think the deer are starting to bed down now jet lag's catching up to me i'm tired but we're gonna find them. We're gonna find the shooter bot. These deer should come off the hill on the backside. Go down to the bottom and bed up in the draw. That's what we're hoping. Bed them up. He had a real nice buck spotted down here, but even if he wasn't broke, I think he's a borderline shooter. He's down there walking stiff-legged. You mean, oh, <laughs> like, oh, wow. How'd you guys do? Woke up feeling a little sicker. But uh, there's a chill that's moved in and uh, shouldn't make the deer moving around good. I started hiking at 5 30 this morning. 6.58 now. So. We're just gonna keep going. We're gonna stick a big old buck today. There's about 10 deer right now. We're trying to see if there's a good buck in there. Should be a good buck. We're just waiting for this buck to get up. Coyotes just got up. Um, so we can see how big he is, if he's worth pursuing. Otherwise, we wanna get to the top of this mountain over here so we can kind of see the lowest. We're going to make a stop today. Looks like that broke off three that we saw yesterday. Oh. He's walking with the deer. Is it the one in back? In front, mm -hmm. I mean. Don't worry about it. It doesn't look like this whole one, does it? Mm -hmm.
clumsy because you're just tripping over everything. It's hard to be quiet. So we're gonna try to get down and you know, loop around. Where you said 72 yards. 72 yards. I heard 55. 72. Shot low. How did I hear 55? You were hoping he was at 55. Huh? You were hoping he was at 55. I just, I don't remember that wind was in my ear. So we're gonna get over there. Hopefully they'll head up the draw towards us. It's time to kill him. We're just that was a warm-up shot. absolutely worn this buck out. Well, I think the doe, he's worn himself out. We keep chasing him and he thinks he's chasing does and does running from us and he thinks the does running from him. And Anyway, he's tired. He's just up there on that juniper hill. I've got him right here in frame. I got some cool footage of him. <laughs> just lip curling.
how thick that brush. Couldn't even shot him. He freaking bolted. It wasn't like they stood up and looked. stick it's like a tree with nothing on it yeah it's right beneath it like 50 yards below the juniper oh yeah they're all looking like it's game time can't make any mistakes here. that's him we're down here on the bottom oh shit yeah it is he's left under Here's the other one. I only got what? 18. Inches of penetration? Not bad, huh? Not bad at all. This is the first arrow right here. Broadhead's still stuck in him. Roughly, I don't know, 15, 17 inches of penetration, maybe. Maybe a little more. Thank you, Mr. Bob. Thank you. This wasn't the buck we chased all trip, but when he was literally going to walk into me at 15, 20 yards. I just, this character, I love character bucks. I just, I just couldn't pass him. Good back forks, good mass. Only had a day and a half left, tall, super tall. We only had a day and a half left to hunt. And I just, I just wanted to take him in. The footage was just awesome. Doesn't get any more organic than this, right here. Pure, organic deliciousness. Grass-fed, gluten-free. Oh, you found my brother. See that. Some rest. I'm feeling my lungs are just filling up with crap. 
losing my voice and stuff. I'm so good. But... Blue, cold, no matter what. Gotta love the desert. This guy, on the other hand, is freaking. He's superhuman. Either that or he's crazy. I think he's crazy. <laughs> 